Do you know? A $50,000 reward will be given to anyone who can provide information that leads to an arrest, or charges or fines over the wolf deaths. The U.S. We begin with humble requests to subscribe to our YouTube channel Save Wildlife and follow us on Facebook and TikTok to support our initiative on wildlife. Fish and Wildlife Service said Friday. Wildlife officials are investigating after gray wolves found dead in Oregon. This story was written by Clara Thornton in USA Today and brought to you by Professor Salim, who is an ecologist. Federal authorities are asking the public for information that could help uncover how three endangered gray wolves died in Oregon. The three wolves were found dead late last year and are the latest gray wolf deaths to be investigated in the state. A $50,000 reward will be given to anyone who can provide information that leads to an arrest, or charges or fines over the wolf deaths, the United States Fish and Wildlife Service said Friday. The reward money is 10 times larger than other rewards for information on previous wolf deaths, according to news releases from Oregon's Department of Fish and Wildlife. One of the three dead wolves was the breeding female for the wolves pack, authorities said. Gray wolves, which were first labeled an endangered species in the 1970s, typically live in packs where only one male or female pair produces pups, according to the United States National Park Service. Two of the dead wolves, including the female, were wearing collars that showed a mortality signal on December 29, officials said. When Oregon State Wildlife officials responded to the site of the signal, they found a third dead wolf without a collar, the United States Fish and Wildlife Service said. The breeding female belonged to Oregon's Gearhart Mountain Pack, the agency said, and the other two wolves were sub-adults in the same pack. Federal authorities have not released information on how the three wolves died last year, and a spokesperson for the United States Fish and Wildlife Service did not immediately respond to requests for comment Monday. Oregon officials continue to monitor the remaining seven members of the Gearhart Mountain Pack, which includes the pack's breeding male, the state's Department of Fish and Wildlife says. Oregon has authorized lethal removal of wolves. Wolves in Oregon have killed or injured livestock dozens of times in the past year, and in some cases, the lethal removal has been authorized by the state's Department of Fish and Wildlife. Wildlife officials have also investigated other wolf deaths that were not authorized, according to press releases from the department. In December 2022, officials were investigating an illegal killing of a gray wolf in the southern part of the state. More recently, authorities said in December 2023 they were investigating another wolf death near Union Creek, Oregon. In both cases, the U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service said they offered a $50,000 reward for information that could lead to the arrest of someone connected to the deaths.